1954, the Knights of Columbus of Whitefish, Montana erected a shrine atop a local ski mountain. Montana skiers from the region fought in Europe during World War II, and the statue was allegedly inspired by shrines seen in the mountains of Italy. The statue was positioned on a 25 foot by 25 foot parcel of leased land close to the main ski lift, looking out into the inspiring view. A 6 foot tall statue of Jesus with 30 inch outstretched arms is elevated on a 6 foot concrete pedestal so that it is accessible in the deep winter snow. The land has been leased from the Flathead National Forest since 1953 and the agreement has been reviewed every 10 years. The purpose of the permit was to erect a shrine overlooking the Big Mountain Ski Area. During a permit review in 2010, the Forest Service asks that the statue be repaired. The informational plaque and fence were constructed at that time. Publicity about the repairs to the statue bring about a public focus, including attention from the Freedom From Religion Foundation complain that a religious site on federal land is inappropriate. Their complaint is found to be valid by the Office of the General Counsel. The Forest Service opts not to reissue the permit. During this process, questions arise about the historical significance of the statue and its potential as a National Register property. National Register nomination evaluation was prepared by the Flathead National Forest and submitted to the Montana State Historic Preservation Office on September 1, 2011. During the evaluation, it was determined that the site is eligible for listing based on Criterion A, its association with the early history and local development of the ski area. It was further revealed that while World War II veterans were likely involved in the creation of the shrine, the idea was brought home by members of the 1949 and 1951 National Ski Team who were involved in the development of the ski mountain. On September 19, 2011, the Montana SHPO concurred with the Forest Service recommendation that the statue was eligible for listing based on Criterion A as well as Criterion F for its commemorative aspect. The National Register eligibility determination does not foreclose active management, including removal or transfer does require that the Forest Service consider the comments of the SHPO and public for proposed changes under 36 CFR 800. To date, over 95,000 responses have been received regarding the status of the shrine. The responses have been significantly in favor of allowing it to remain, but opposition has also been voiced. Based on the public response, the Forest Service renewed the permit on January 31, 2012 as a conditional use for another 10 years. In response to the renewal, on February 8, 2012, Freedom From Religion Foundation sues the Flathead National Forest for removal of the statue. The lawsuit asks that the court prevent the Forest Service from continuing to approve the shrine on federal property and order the Knights of Columbus to remove it. The Department of Justice is advocating the position that the site is not religious in its use but is part of the historical ski experience. Regardless of the positions, it is anticipated that the case may go unresolved for years, potentially reaching the Supreme Court. As the case has developed, a number of potential solutions have emerged, including a potential land swap, a relocation of the statue to adjacent private land, or a relocation to another private site of the Knights of Columbus choosing. Regardless of the final outcome, the case remains an example of the complexities that can arise with issues of cultural resource management and the interpretation of Section 106 of the National Historic Preservation Act.